you might think money isn't a big deal when you're a teenager. You've got bigger things to worry about, right? Think again. Understanding money now gives you a huge head start in life. It's like having a secret weapon for your future. This book will teach you things they don't cover in school. You'll learn how to make your money work for you, not the other way around. Many people struggle with money their whole lives because they never learned the basics. Don't let that be you. This book is your guide to financial freedom. It's about taking control of your money so you can live life on your own terms. No more depending on others for financial security. Imagine being able to afford the things you want, travel the world and pursue your passions without money worries. That's the power of financial literacy. This book is your first step toward achieving those dreams. It's time to ditch the idea that money is boring or complicated. It's actually exciting and empowering when you know how to manage it well. Let's dive in and unlock the secrets to financial success. This book tells the story of two dads, one rich, one poor. It's about the different ways they thought about money. The poor dad worked hard his whole life but always struggled financially. The rich dad thought differently. He believed in building assets and making money work for him. The rich dad also believed in taking calculated risks and learning from mistakes. Which dad do you think ended up more financially successful? You guessed it. The rich dad. Let's talk about assets and liabilities. This is where the rubber meets the road in personal finance. Assets put money in your pocket, liabilities take money out. Knowing the difference is crucial for building wealth. Examples of assets include businesses, real estate, and stocks. Liabilities include debt, mortgages, and car loans. Focus on acquiring assets and minimizing liabilities. Prioritize building wealth first, then enjoy later. Investing is one of the most powerful ways to grow your money over time. Think of it like planting a seed. The sooner you plant it, the more time it has to grow into a mighty tree. When you invest, you're essentially buying a piece of something that you believe will increase in value over time. There are many different ways to invest, and the best approach for you will depend on your age, risk tolerance, and financial goals. Some popular investment options include stocks, buying shares of ownership in publicly traded companies, bonds, lending money to governments or corporations in exchange for interest payments, Mutual funds, pooling your money with other investors to buy a diversified portfolio of stocks, bonds, or other assets. Real estate investing in rental properties or flipping houses for profit. Don't be intimidated by the world of investing. There are plenty of resources available to help you get started, including books, websites, and financial advisors. The most important thing is to start early and be patient. Investing is a long-term game, and the sooner you start, the more time your money has to grow. Even small, consistent investments can add up to significant wealth over time. Have you ever dreamed of being your own boss and calling the shots? Entrepreneurship is a fantastic way to achieve financial freedom and pursue your passions. The rich dad in this book was a big believer in starting businesses. Starting a business doesn't have to be scary or complicated. It could be as simple as mowing lawns, babysitting, or selling handmade crafts online. The key is to identify a need in the market and offer a solution. Being an entrepreneur teaches you valuable skills like creativity and problem solving, coming up with new ideas and finding solutions to challenges. Financial literacy, managing your money, tracking expenses and making smart investments. Sales and marketing, promoting your business and convincing customers to buy your products or services. Leadership and teamwork, building a team and motivating others to achieve a common goal. Even if you don't end up starting your own business, the skills you learn as an entrepreneur will be valuable in any career path you choose. So don't be afraid to think outside the box and explore your entrepreneurial spirit. The rich dad believed in challenging conventional wisdom and thinking differently about money. He didn't follow the traditional path of getting a good job and working for someone else his whole life. He encouraged his children to think for themselves and find their own paths to success. Sometimes, what everyone else is doing isn't necessarily the best way. For example, many people believe that going to college is the only way to get a good job and be successful. While college can be a great option for some, it's not the only path to success. There are many successful entrepreneurs and business leaders who never finished college or took a different path altogether. The key is to find what works for you and don't be afraid to blaze your own trail. The rich dad also believed in learning from mistakes and not being afraid to fail. He saw failure as a stepping stone to success 
and an opportunity to learn and grow. So don't be afraid to take risks and step outside your comfort zone. The greatest lessons are often learned through trial and error. Want to achieve financial success? It all starts with setting clear goals and creating a plan to reach them. Think of it like planning a road trip. You wouldn't just hop in the car and start driving without a destination in mind, would you? The same goes for your finances. Without a roadmap, you're more likely to wander off course and not reach your full potential. Start by setting SMART goals. SMART stands for Specific, clearly define what you want to achieve. Instead of saying I want to be rich, say I want to save $10,000 for a down payment on a house. Measurable. Make your goals quantifiable so you can track your progress. Achievable, set realistic goals that you can actually accomplish. Relevant. Choose goals that are meaningful to you and align with your values. Time bound. Set a deadline for achieving your goals to stay motivated. Once you have your goals in place, create a plan of action to achieve them. This might involve creating a budget, tracking your spending, or finding ways to increase your income. The important thing is to take action and stay consistent. Building your financial IQ exercises for success. Rich Dad. Poor Dad for Teens isn't just about reading and absorbing information. It's about putting what you learn into practice. The book includes various exercises and activities to help you develop your financial IQ and apply the concepts to real-life situations. Here are some examples. Tracking your cash flow. Keep a journal to track where your money is going each month. This will help you identify areas where you can cut back on spending and save more. Creating a budget. Develop a spending plan that allocates your income to different categories, such as housing, food, transportation, and entertainment. Playing the Cash Flow 101 game. This interactive board game, created by Robert Kiyosaki, teaches you about investing, real estate, and financial strategies in a fun and engaging way. The more you practice these exercises, the more comfortable you'll become with managing your money and making smart financial decisions. The importance of mentors. Finding your rich dad. Having a mentor can make a huge difference in your financial journey. A mentor is someone who has already achieved what you want to achieve and can offer guidance, support, and advice along the way. The rich dad in this book served as a mentor to Robert Kiyosaki, teaching him valuable lessons about money and business that he wouldn't have learned elsewhere. You might be wondering, where can I find a mentor? Mentors can come from all walks of life. They could be family members, teachers, coaches, or successful entrepreneurs in your community. Don't be afraid to reach out to people you admire and ask for advice. Most successful people are happy to share their knowledge and help others succeed. You never know, you might just find your own rich dad who can guide you on your path to financial freedom. Overcoming fear and taking risks. Fear can be a major roadblock to financial success. Fear of failure, fear of the unknown, and fear of making mistakes can hold you back from taking the necessary steps to achieve your goals. The rich dad in this book encouraged his children to embrace risk and not be afraid of making mistakes. He believed that failure is a part of the learning process and that the greatest lessons are often learned through trial and error. Of course, this doesn't mean you should be reckless with your money. It's important to do your research, weigh the risks and rewards, and make calculated decisions. But don't let fear paralyze you from taking action. Remember the biggest risk is not taking any risks at all. By stepping outside your comfort zone and embracing challenges, you open yourself up to new opportunities and possibilities. Building a secure future. Your financial journey starts now. Congratulations. By reading this essay, you've taken the first step toward building a brighter financial future for yourself. You've learned about the importance of financial literacy, the difference between assets and liabilities, the power of investing, and the value of an entrepreneurial mindset. Remember, financial success is not a destination, it's a journey. There will be ups and downs along the way, but by applying the principles outlined in Rich Dad Poor Dad for Teens, you'll be well equipped to navigate the challenges and achieve your financial goals. The most important takeaway is to start now. Don't wait until you're older or have more money. The sooner you start developing good financial habits, the better off you'll be in the long run. So go out there and make your dreams a reality. The world is your oyster, and with the right knowledge and mindset, you can achieve anything you set your mind to. Your financial journey starts now.